Hi, my name is Dana Lee Cohen, and I'm here at the El Sol Brillante Junior Garden on 12th Street between Avenue A and B, where I've been keeping bees for about four years. Oh. Hello, my darlings. How are you today? It's not raining, so we thought we'd show you off to New York City, where the plague of Giuliani is almost over. I didn't even realize that it was illegal. I just took a class upstate. I thought, oh, great, I'm going to get some bees. And uh, I talked to my, um, my garden, and uh, they, they actually were willing to let me keep the bees here. Everybody I spoke to from, you know, uh, all the gardening organizations and the parks organizations really wanted the law to change. The law was a Department of Health law. The law actually had a sentence that you couldn't keep uh, ferrets, bears, or honeybees. Anybody want to have a little bit of honey? Come on, Mommy's hand and have I some. Oh, here she, here she comes. Here she comes. Giuliani was wrong about a lot of things. He was definitely wrong about the honeybee. And I'm so happy that the city council is voting on this tomorrow. It's an exciting moment for us. And I hope many people will keep bees the way I do because it, has, it is the greatest hobby I ever got involved in. I recommend it as a hobby, as I say. And the more beekeepers we have, the better because so many of these farmers are so involved with thinking about money and making money off of the bees and the honey. They don't take the time to talk to them or to show them love or to be gentle and and the bees are just dying left and right. They're, they're heartbroken by this mistreatment. You know, just like a puppy that wants to be adopted, they, they're not going to bite you. They have nothing to protect further. So when you see a swarm, you don't have to be afraid of them. They're, they're at their most docile. You know, all you have to do is remember three little digits, three, one, one. Dial them and, and let us take care of them. Everybody out of the way. We're closing up shop. That's it. That's it. Good girls.